What? What the f- Alright guys, so we're gonna record a special kind of video today. The developer of this game contacted me through email and asked me if I would play this game, which of course I'd said yes. Uh, took it as an honor to be playing a game, especially in, in, in its early development uh, stage. This is an exclusive demo. This game is called Pixidus. It's a point and click adventure. Lucky for me, I have never played a point and click adventure before, so this is going to be something new. Something's going to—it's it's, going to be uh, hard to get used to, hard to adjust, but we'll get through it. So, let's get started. This game is called Pixidus. Again, I'm very new to this genre, so this is this is a, a bit of a treat. All right, so we're actually playing uh, as a pig. Cool. All right, so what a dream. I'd better find Egg Eggdar, and we'll know what to make of this. Okay, here we go. Quick tutorial. W A S D. Okay, standard controls to move Horus. Take it. That's the pig. Left and right. Press A and D. W to jump. C to trigger smell mode. And you gotta use the mouse. Okay. Left click to talk to characters. Left click to interact with objects. To examine things. I got it. Okay, I get it. Thank you. All right. Jump. Damn. This pick and jump. <laughs> All right, here we go. What is this? What do you got for me? Hey there, Ryan. Have you seen Eggdar? Perhaps. But wouldn't you like to talk about my gadgets? Nay. Okay. Uh, nay. Don't you like me? <laughs> Uh, <laughs> should we be an asshole and just say no? <laughs> say nope. You make me sad. Oh, I'm so sorry. Okay. I knew it. So I have this. this oh, gee. Whoa, 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 whoa. He's going fast. Want to hear more? Do I have a choice? Not really. They have a crystal razor for grip. Holy crap. <laughs> Ryan, please. It's really fascinating, but I have to find Eggdar. It's a weird name, Eggdar. You're talking way too fast. Okay, so that's supposed to happen. The, the, the horse is supposed to talk really fast. Eggdar was here early morning. He hit a north for you somewhere around here. I had the impression he was in a playful mood. Interesting. Do you see where he hid the note by any chance? Again, guys, we're going in this completely blind. I mean, the only thing I've seen it was the trailer, and the trailer looks interesting. Okay, so now we're going to go find a note. Some inconspicuous boxes. Can I jump? Okay. Damn. I guarantee it's probably up there. Uh, so let's keep going. <laughs> oh, God. oh man, that's crazy. Oh shit. Alright. So I assume we gotta go over there, but I'm gonna find the note. And we jump. And we jump. And what is in here? Nothing. Here? Looks like some paint cans to look ancient. None shall pass. Uh, I don't see the note. Is it somewhere else? Not there. Okay. Window, okay. Ryan the gadget horse. No, hell no, please. <laughs> Do you see where you hit the note by any chance? I wasn't paying attention. What did it say? Nope, but you can probably use your famous nose to find it. Ah, that's why I didn't read. Okay, so. C. C is nose. Oh, there it is. That's cool, that's a cool mechanic. Boing. 
<laughs> yeah, that's a very cool mechanic. I like that. All right, shut that off. There's a note. Note from Eggdar. It reads, "Dear Oinkstein, <laughs> Horace Oinkstein." Okay, we have much to discuss. P.S. You squeal like a pig in your sleep. Oh, interesting. I don't. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Hi, right, Eggdar. I'm actually quite curious as to why he made you squeal like a pig. And or what you were doing. Alright, so we're gonna go make a left. I don't know where this is gonna take me. This game has a... Uh, has kind of like a Tim Schafer feel. Okay, what's this chicken? Tim Schafer, is that his name? Is it Tim Schafer? I don't even know. Who are you? Eggdar, my best friend. I found him. Cool. Eggdar, so glad I found you. Good to see you too, pal. I had the strangest dream. I saw a huge toad with glowing eyes. You sure, Oinkstein? Is it Oinkstein or Oinkstein? What do you guys think? Oh, okay. Well, well, b b what? Belzebufu? Just because your science cannot explain stuff. Yo, man, this took a weird turn. This guy's talking about demons and stuff. Our chick shaman is just a con contact See so what I mean? It's a demon. By ingesting a certain mushroom. Oh. Demons and mushrooms. Uh, what the bells of Bufu? Oh. Interesting. The demon of death. Okay. What mushrooms? Well, I don't know the Latin name, but I know it grows east, near the giant bug tree. A vision quest. I embark immediately. Cool idea, but count me out. There's no way I'm going to sneak past these wolves again. Oh god, so you make me do wolves too? Yep, don't you remember? Last time we went to the tree, I got nearly eaten. I'm staying here. You need to open yourself a gate. Fortunately, I left a little snack for our rac raccoon friend in the toolbox. Okay. Near the tractor shed. Good luck, Einstein. All right. So I gotta look for a toolbox. You gotta tell me the whole story. All right. So we're looking for a toolbox now, and a raccoon apparently. I'm so amazed as to how high this pig could jump. Yeah, there's only one point and click adventure game I've always wanted to play, and that was Grim Fandango. What's this? Oh. You got a carrot. I guess I carry it with me. Yo, that's two ducks. Or two, two chickens hanging upside down. Well, not upside down, but from their beaks. Or from their necks, excuse me. Ox. Farmer's choice. What you'll do? What the duck? Oh! <laughs> These ducks are really colorful. You quack me up, ducks. That's pretty funny. I liked it. This game has charm. You can appreciate that. Alright, so we got other pigs. Oh! Hello. Okay. I get, I get the feeling that this game, once it's released, is going to get dark. Alright, so there's the raccoon. I'm going to guess that this is the key. Yep. I like Kazam. Hello, Mr. Raccoon. Okay, what's this? Enemies ahead. Outsmart them by hiding and leveraging the patrolling habits. S S to hide. While this icon's in the top right, you corner you cannot hide. Okay. I get it. I got you. So S. So what do I do now? We'll go. <gasps> huh. I guess I'll wait a little bit. Three, two, one, and go. Boom. Gotcha. Okay, I got this. I got this. Go and boom. Jump. Oh, boom. Shit. Excuse the language. <laughs> up. Up. Ah. Oh, man. 
Okay, so I can't jump over them. This is strictly like Metal Gear Solid. I have to be very sneaky. Go, 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 go. Hi, damn it. Three, two, one, go. And hide. Yes. And jump. Cool, cool, cool. Okay, we got this. We got this. All right. I got you. I got you. I'm going to jump over the fool. Never mind. No, where you going? Stop. Don't move. So I have to hide. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna do something very ballsy. I'm gonna wait for him because I apparently yeah I can't oh god jump over him. Oh cool it worked wow it worked awesome. All right, so if we go up, 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 where does this take me? That's the tree, so I have to go up here. Okay, can't see the mushroom though. Maybe these little bugs can help me. Okay. Little bug, it looks really lost. Little bug looks lost. Okay, so what do I do? Do I take you? Okay, I grab you, put you there. No, ah, I see. I see. I see. Man, you really gotta think in this game. <laughs> Well, I don't know. Maybe because I've never played shit like this before. I heard a popping sound at the bottom of the tree. This is cool. I like this. I like it so far. Gulp tasty. Oh, God. Now what's going to happen? I knew it. It was one of those mushrooms. Yep, definitely. He's hallucinating. Yeah, there's something up with that mushroom. Your lack of vision has put you in peril. Seek me out in the forbidden place. Seek me out or perish. I wish I had a better voice so that I could actually, like, you know, act out the roles and shit. Ouch. Got more. What is that noise? Okay, so we've got exploration. We've got... Uh, wow, we've got combat. So we've got exploration. You've got uh, platforming. You've got uh, puzzle solving, apparently. And you got sneaking around. Now you've got combat. Yo, this game's got it all. All right, let's see. Let's read this shit. Uh, each combat round has two phases. First, you choose your tactics. There's only one. Enter this demo. You choose by pressing enter. In the second phase, beat many games to improve your chance to strike. Hit the keyboard like a wild hog to overcome panic. Press more than one key. Repeat it into the counter below. Okay. Uh, okay. Okay. I got it. I got it. I got it. So. Oh, wow. Uh, enter. Oh, oh, God. Uh, bam. Oh, sh Jesus. Oh, God. Uh, smack. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, uh, oh, man. <laughs> I can't. Bam. What the hell? What's it doing? Sma what? I don't I don't get it. Why didn't it work? Headbutt. Oh, so you gotta type really quick and you gotta... I see. I see. I see. Okay. But I get hit too. Okay. Uh, enter. Um... I don't, okay, I don't understand that one. That's, that's one thing I don't understand just yet. It says hit diff different keys, but it's, you know, you gotta do it quick. Enter. I don't, I don't I, I quite understand how that one works. What did I do? Yeah, I don't understand how this minigame stuff works. Sometime later. Uh oh, what's going on? That truck, it took my parents. Don't you run on me, you stupid pig. Help, he's going to shoot. Oh, wow. So this is gonna be like a kind of, I thought this was a child's game. This is gonna be like a children's game. No, man, it's a straight up adult. Well, not adult, but like, it's it's dark. Dark in the sense of like there's killing and, and, and adult themes and stuff. All right. Great hogs. Oh, okay. He tried to shoot Henry. Help. Help. I want to go back home. Great hog. Please take my soul. <laughs> Bob, Joe, Greg. 
Bob Joe Greg, what sorcery is this? What is this? Where are we going? Daddy, help, where are we going? Are we going to die? Daddy, help. Okay, so that doesn't work. Oh, quiet, you're not helping. You're right. You need to get out of here, any ideas? Nope. None, I'm blank. We could just jump out of here. I keep forgetting you gotta click on these guys to talk. But it seems impossible with all this wobbling. Hmm. One of us could get out. If we stand on each other's backs. Forming a pyramid, <laughs> so to speak. Should be you, Oinkstein. You're the smartest. I think it's Oinkstein. I could be wrong. Okay, so what do I do? Bob, stand on the left side. Joe, stand near Bob. Too heavy, can't hold him. The pyramid is falling. Bob. Who's Bob? Bob, stand on the left side. Joe, stand near Bob. Pilgrimage is falling. Okay, so... Mm, do I... Okay, I'm confused. Help us all. Hold on, I'll be right. I'll be back with help. I'm confused. I'm a little bit confused as to how this stuff works. So I guess I jump off. Yes, I do. Ow. Do you want to know what happens next? I assume this is where the demo ends. Let's see what happens if we push yes. Yeah, see, it just takes you back. It just takes you to their Kickstarter page. I like it so far. I'm a little confused as to how the combat works. I guess how some of the puzzles are going to work. But overall, it's excellent. I, I like it. I, do I see myself playing this game when it's released? More than likely, yes. Look out for pics of this out in the future. And yeah, man, that that's it guys you know i'm gonna put their kickstarter page down below i don't know when the game is gonna get released just check them out you know thank you to the guys at silo side games I, i'm i'm sorry if i completely butchered your name this game is awesome keep up the good work and i can't wait to see how it plays and how it turns out so with that being said my name is duke thank you all so much for watching i'll see you guys next time